you want to see me fight Tony again, I want to see me fight Tony again. Uh, so if he wins, then, then that makes a great fight. And, and Khabib, I've been after him for years, and, and that's the one that I've been really, really wanting to get at. So uh, it, it, them, them both give me motivation to come back down to 55 and make a name. And what do you think it is about him, too? Because everybody kind of knows what he's going to do. And, yeah. and he manages to do it, which is, is almost harder. Everyone knows what his game plan is, and he manages to still pull it off. You mean Khabib? Yeah. I mean, I don't know. He just, he just, you know, people see him as like this Terminator. He's just like, he, you know, you know the Terminator going to show up, and you know he's going to shoot. Like, what you, what you going to do back to him? I don't know. It's, it's hard for me to say because I haven't been in there with him. So it, it's hard for me to say why people don't. Uh, uh, be able to, to to defend that or be able to look at it. I, I don't know. I, I won't know until I get in there. But you know, when I do, I'm just gonna focus on my strength. I'm not gonna focus on what he's doing or what he's trying to do. I'm gonna go out there and I'm gonna do it to him. You haven't seen anybody want to put him on his back yet. So uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see how that whole thing play out. Jim Norton, Kevin Lee, having a conversation of the century. Uh, Ferguson versus Nurmagomedov. Khabib versus Tony. Um, this is whew, fire and water. Depends who you see as fire. I see Khabib as fire. I see Tony as water, man. Um, Tony is going to be Khabib's toughest fight because he has weapons that go beyond just wrestling and oh, let me say this right. You just heard Kevin Lee say that we have never seen anybody try to do to Khabib what Khabib is doing to other people, right? 100% right. Tony Ferguson has the skills to do that. I think he's an NCAA Division One wrestler, I'm not sure. Um, Tony can't do that. Tony's jiu-jitsu is predicated on you taking him down. His rubber guard is fire. And let's not forget, man... Tony fought Kevin Lee when Kevin Lee had a staff infection on his chest. We all saw it. He wasn't 100%. Kevin Lee could barely make weight for that fight. So, yeah, I agree with him, man. We have to see that fight. But, interesting Kevin Lee would say this, right? Because I don't know if people remember this, but before Kevin Lee started losing a bit, you know, uh, his last two fights he lost, he fought Edson Barboza. And he did... To Edson Barboza, what Khabib did, but in higher quality, despite his mishaps. Um, maybe I shouldn't call them mishaps. Um, he got caught by Edson Barboza. We all remember the chicken dance he did. But he recovered into a single leg and destroyed Edson Barboza. Edson went five rounds with Khabib, right? Kevin Lee went four. Just saying, guys. I mean, that's a hell of a fight anywhere on earth. And let's not forget, let's not forget, man. Kevin Lee can wrestle his ass off too, man. He's had hard times, you know, the whole making weight thing. I really think they should make a 163 uh, weight class or at least from... They move 170 to 175, 155, 165, 175. See? And they add a 195 in there too, man. Um, the jump between middleweight and light heavyweight may be too much for any athlete. Um, let's consider that with the Chris Weidman loss. Shout out to Chris Weidman, the whole American American. Um, listen, sorry, uh, maybe time to retire. I don't know. That's all up to you. Let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'm out. How do you feel about it? Yeah, Conor McGregor, you're taking everything I work for, my. I'm a fight, jerk. You know what's the real fight? What's the real money fight? It's me. Not these clowns that you already punked at the press conference. Don't no one want to see that. You know you beat them already. That's the easy fight. You want that real right here. Hey, and I'm not. Unfortunately, we can't talk like that on Fox.